So here we are together at the end of the peace videos and we're at peace skill number 11. Create a peace ending. Well, you can't fail at this. You cannot fail. And here's why. Because you don't need a treaty. You don't need all the parties to agree that, okay, now we're, we have unity, now we have justice. But you can create little peace endings along the way. Like, let's say that you were with me and you were so upset Let's say you're upset at something Joe did to you and you just can't get past it. And I've listened to you and I've been an observer, loving, and unconditional positive regard of you. And we've talked about solutions, but then you slip back into the story and say, I don't think I'm ready for this. And I might say to you, you know what? This has been a good airing out today. We've had a, it's been a good conversation. I'm so grateful you shared your heart and I think it's a good time to just stop and let you have time to reflect on what's happened and I'd love to get together with you again if you want to talk more uh, but I think this is a good place just to acknowledge wow we've covered a lot of ground today we're not we're not at peace yet but we've it's good to get the feelings out and it's good for you to know how much I love you and I care for your heart. That is a peace ending. Doesn't that feel good? Doesn't, we haven't arrived at peace, but it's a peace ending. You can have a peace ending any, at any point of the conflict. Somebody is screaming their head off and, you're, and, and let's say you're out of time. You, you don't have any more time because life is moving forward. You gotta go pick up the kids or whatever. You might say, you know what? Wow, there's just so much, so much that you're saying, and I'm really hearing your frustration and your anger. And I would like to just listen to you and allow you to move through this and with this for another hour. But I don't, I can't do that now. But I would love to provide that opportunity if you'd like to continue. I hate to leave things right where we're so like going crazy here, but I think it's been good that I really acknowledge you for having the courage to get your feelings out. And let's get together. Uh, what 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 would you like to say in closing? Like let's just we, we got to leave in five minutes. What would what would you like to share with me before we we wrap up and we have to go? Because this has been really, I think I've appreciated your being so transparent and open. That's a peace ending. So, let me end this peace series by saying to you that it really doesn't matter to me where you are in your conflicts, at what stage that you're in, or what stage you're in yourself of wondering, are you really a good love master? Can you be somebody who's an expert at creating peace? Whatever stage you're in in that, I honor you for being with me right now, listening. We're partners right now, uh, talking about love. And I really admire you for being here, being part of this conversation about peace. And I hope you, I wish you all love and all success and just stay with it. Peace is a process. I love you.